Firefighters are called in to help fight a two-alarm fire on board a fishing boat in the Port of Providence. We first told you about it as it was breaking on Eyewitness News at noon. And tonight, we're learning more about how it started. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen is live in studio with the new details tonight. 70-foot fishing vessel was engulfed in flames just as firefighters arrived on scene just after 11 this morning. And now we've learned a welding mishap is what's to blame. The fire on the Sea Angel sent plumes of smoke into the air, and we're told it could be seen over some areas of lower downtown Providence. It was quite a scene this morning. Fortunately, nobody was hurt. A delivery driver tells us he could see smoke and flames all the way from the highway. I come down the highway, I see billows of smoke, and I says, it's just my luck, it's going to be right where I'm going. And it was, got about here, seen the flames, kept going, turned around, asked, they said, we got a fire. They were doing some welding work on the ship, and that appears that's the way the uh, ship got, the fire got uh, started. We deployed some firefighters initially on the boat quickly just to secure the boat, and we removed them, and we fought the fire from the dock. And the fire chief also told us the department's new foam pumper truck was also called in to help extinguish the flames. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.